Okay, so we've got the body blocked out. We have the projected curve for the mouth sorted out. And so what do we need to do next? Well, we have the tentacles. Okie dokie, let's take a look at them. And there's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so create curve tools, CV curve tool, and let's create the first tentacle. So it comes along like this. Around there. Boom, we've done it. Now, if you want to, you can just shape them a bit better, you know, reposition them if you want to. But it looks fine as it is. There we go. And yeah, there we go. Okay, look, so. Let's take a look. All right, that's the first one done. And we've got the second one. So, there we go. That's two. Now, if you take a look at these two curves, they are of different heights, as you can see. However, in the drawing, you get the impression that the bottom part of the curve, which is the tentacle here and here, both sit on the ground. But as you can see here, it doesn't. Now, this more or less will, once we've extruded it and created a tentacle, but this one doesn't. So. We actually need to reshape it at some point, but for now I'm just creating the curves and we can deal with all the other stuff afterwards. There we go. Now again, this actually comes out so it's in front of the body, but as you can see, it isn't. So again, you know, uh, this is all stuff we're going to do afterwards. For now, we're just getting the curves down. And boom, 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 boom. There we go. There we go. Oh, we can reshape this if we want to, you know, just... Yeah, looks fine. There we go. And one more. There we have it. Let's take a look. Let's just position these CVs a bit better. Bom, bom, bom. There you go, looks fine. Okay, look. So, there you go, we've created the curves for the tentacles. And so, we'll end the video here, and uh, I'll see you next video where we will continue with these tentacles.